So, you guys, this is the final result. Uh. Hello, beloved! Welcome back to my channel, Beloved Nerlin. Anyways, I hope you're able to watch my previous vlog. It's about the DIY earring. Yeah, that one. And I hope I was able to, you know, help, especially the beautiful women out there. But now, I'm gonna do another DIY video, but this time, it's going to be super risky. If ever this goes, you know, the wrong way, I'm really gonna regret this for the rest of my life. But I hope not, because I'm now super desperate and I'm really gonna do it. There's no backing um, out of it. Yeah, so let's, let's do it. So as you can see, um, beloved, I have a, I actually have a curly hair, but it's not that curly now because I had it rebonded last year, but now, you know, because of the grown hair. So I'm, I'm showing you <laughs> how I really look like without my, my, you know, hair band. So see, it's kinky at the top and the back, you should see. Hair rebonding here in Japan cost too much, too much money maybe um, 20,000 yen and that's if we convert into Philippine money that would be like 8,000 so I'm like what no I'm not gonna um, you know spend that much money on my hair well in the Philippines it's it's not that expensive but yeah I'm gonna do this anyway so let's let's do it join me oh my lord help me so first I'm just gonna wash my, my hair until all the chemicals are gone from the shampoo or the conditioner that I used yesterday. So I'll be right back. So now, before applying the straightener um, solution, I'm going to wear this one. <laughs> I actually bought this from Daiso, from the $1 store here in Japan. And it's a set. It's actually for um, dyeing your hair, but I'm using it for rebonding. <laughs> so inside here, inside this um, Inside, there are four items. We have the cake, the, glo the gloves, the ear covers, and the bra. So let's do it. <laughs> We're really gonna do it. So, okay. So first, we need to apply the H1. So I have the, here the Shiseido Crystallizing Straight. So it's a thermal straight system. So I bought this from, um, from the Amazon. So you can check it there if you want to buy and do the DIY. So you need to have one cup. Okay, and this hair comb and brush. And yeah, maybe we can use this also when we're already ironing our hair after washing it. And yeah, two cups. So. Okay, there you go. So now let's apply it. So, okay, so you should put th this one um, one centimeter away from your scalp to be safe. Okay. I can't believe I'm doing this. And so I'm back. After one hour, <laughs> oh. it was indeed a tedious process. It took me one hour, so I don't really suggest it if you do it, you know, alone. You need to have someone to help you. Oh. I'm really nervous about this one. I don't know if it's gonna work. But... Okay, so um, everyone, it's already past 20 minutes, so I need to rinse it, and I'll be back afterwards. Let's blow dry. So I just, um, <laughs> I just want to show you um, one positive thing after applying the the straight 
straightener cream or solution. Um, take a look at the roots of my hair. Like it's no longer kinky. Okay, so we are done um, blow drying our hair. Now it's time to iron it. So you must set your hair iron um, up to 180 degrees. Not, I think more than that is going to burn your hair. So let's just keep it um, until 180 degrees. And so guess what? Yeah, I don't have you know the proper gloves. Um, uh, that you use when you iron. So I have here my mittens. <laughs> I'm gonna use it. I have no choice because it's really hot. So I'm gonna wear these mittens here. Oh wow. See? It worked. Okay. So I'm done with my hair. I ironed my entire hair. And I would say it's really challenging. It, it would be better if you have someone with you to help you, especially the back part. Okay, so we need to apply the um, number two. So this is the number one. This is the one I applied on my hair um, during the first step. So the straightener. <laughs> and the next one is the neutralizing cream. It smells good, unlike the other one. neutralizing cream so um, you just have to wait for two to three minutes that is it for two to three minutes and then after that we can rinse it off okay so I'm back um, so I actually rinse the neutralize uh, neutralizing cream out of my hair so um, after rinsing I actually applied um, a conditioner so any available conditioner that you have you can apply that one so now, what we're gonna do is let's um, dry it again using our blow dryer. Now look at that! <laughs> this is how it looks like after blow drying my hair without um, ironing it. We still have to do that, but look at the results! It's, I think it's successful. I'm so excited to get done with this, but we still have to iron it. What more after ironing it? Oh. See? <laughs> to be honest, I'm so impressed. The curls or the kinky parts are no more. Hmm. Okay, so I'm gonna iron my hair and then Important in the process of rebonding your hair, and it takes a lot of time. So, you guys, this is the final result. Uh, yeah, I'm so happy. So, um, I want to show you the back side of my hair. It's not that easy. It took me five to six hours. Yeah, especially the you know the hair ironing. That's the most difficult part because you have to be um, very careful not to miss um, some parts of your hair. But now, uh, thank you so much for uh, joining me in this vlog. So if you have um, questions or, um, about the procedures, the materials, just drop it and I'll get back to you if I have time. So this has been Beloved Norlin and don't forget to, to subscribe to our channel Beloved Norlin. Thank you! God bless Beloved!